the grain turned to empty husks and the rivers dried up. Innocent people died by the tens of thousands until at last the other gods were forced to act lest they have no worshippers left. So yes, we know this rule. This has always been the case. The golden rule has merely brought it into focus. Well, focus. Yeah, definitely Greek. What can we do about it? If we are to survive, I say we must each keep the simple wisdom of Thales of Miletus, first of the seven sages of Greece, who said, Avoid doing what you would blame others for doing. That's actually really wise. Avoid doing what you would blame others for doing. I like that. I like that. It does, doesn't it? But it is not enough for us to do this alone. For even if 99% of us adopt this principle, that will never be enough. Sadly, no matter how well we protect Might, ourselves, maybe, yeah. the life's work of many good people can be undone in the blink of an eye by a single selfish act. Well, actually, is it is it wise? Because if you avoid doing what you would blame others for doing, this comes back to the whole subjectivity point. Because what I would blame other people for doing things would be completely different from what other people would blame other people for doing things. What I deem as immoral is completely different from somebody else's opinion. You'd have to be in a society where everybody thought the same thing. I don't, I don't think the golden rule in principle would ever work. I, I, I can, I, I can, I mean, it's inevitability. It is going to turn, is going to, somebody's going to break the rule. So we've seen that. So it doesn't work. Uh, the life's work of many people can be done undone in the blink of an eye by a single selfish act. Ah, the voice of experience. I am sorry for your loss, my friend, but on a lighter note, I will say one thing for the golden rule. For all their grim and haunting poses, these golden statues do make magnificent models for my clothing, <laughs> do they not? <laughs> Who's threatening Virgil? This is troubling, is it not? I'm afraid I have no idea. It is ridiculous though, Virgil is a fine man. But my young friend Fabia confided in me that she saw someone leaving graffiti on his shop front last night. Perhaps you should ask her about it. Fabia, let's go. I hope that our paths cross again soon, my friend. Where is Fabia? Wo wo is... Uh, where is Fabia? How do we know where Fabia is? Are you Fabia? Are they? Are they? <laughs> I don't know who Fabia is. She said farmhand, didn't he? Yep. You look well, my sartorial friend. Hello again, my sartorial friend. What is on your mind? This is troubling, is it not? Uh, I, but skip. my young friend Fabia confided in me that she nope. saw someone leaving graffiti on his shop front last night. I hope that our young friend Fabia. We are okay. We just have to find her. Oh. Help! You have to do something. A man arrived in the baths. A real nasty sort, with his face all covered up. And he's got a weapon. You have to do something, or he's gonna break the golden rule. Shit. You watched the video, it looks great. Can't wait to see what other bosses look like. Yeah, 100 percent mate, yeah. Uh it's on Steam to wishlist. If you want to wishlist it, it should give you some updates and the um the development process. Uh, I'll get right on it. I'll see what I can do. How? I don't have a weapon. Wait, who are you? Any ideas who threaten Virgil? How is this my problem? This will prioritize the new quest, showing it as objective markers only. 
Some dialogues are timed. Okay. Thank you. He's still in there. Somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this empty shrine when it's over. What? Did you hear that? Hear what? Heard a voice. What? You know. We don't have time for this. I have to go. Ugh. Oh, she's pissed off. The shrine is collapsing. Try and make a collapse at any moment. You should have read the warning, love. Fabia, no! That was Fabia? Oh God, she's dead. Did anyone see that? The whole shrine just collapsed on her. Oh, Fabia, why did you have to go in there? Poor sweet girl. Shit. I can't believe she is dead. Fabia, I mean. She walked into that empty shrine, and the next moment she is lying dead under a pile of rubble. The gods are cruel and unjust. She was like a daughter to me. I'm sorry, friends. It's not right for me to lay my burden upon you. Oh, great. Oh, good lord, he's got a bow. Stop right there. I am looking for Tiberius Quinctius Crispus, Crispus. otherwise known as Quinctius. Quin Do you know where he is? Quinctius. I don't know a Quinctius. I'm not sure I believe that, so allow me to explain something to you. I am here with orders from Emperor Nero himself to find and execute the cultist Quinctius for terrible crimes against the Empire. So, if you tell me the truth, I will allow you to live. But if you lie to me or otherwise oh, obstruct the Emperor's business so in any made way, I will put this arrow through your chest. Is that understood? Okay. Thank you. Now tell me, who are you people and what is this place? We're a small community of strangers who wound up and uh, up here by accident. A small community. <laughs> I was told Quinctius was a cultist, but I never thought he'd be foolish enough to lead me right to the heart of his mystery cult. What is a... What? Wait, what's a mystery cult? You've got the wrong idea. We're not cultists. What's a mystery cult? Oh, don't play coy with me. I don't care if you're worshipping Bacchus, Magna Mater, or Christ. You lot are all the same to me. Always sneaking off to your secret sanctuaries, indoctrinating each other with your little mantras. You can see his chin. The Emperor may have tolerated your activities up until now, but after what Quinctius did, Quinctius. those days are numbered. We're not cultists. You say that, but if you're not a cult, then why go to such great lengths to keep this place a secret? Uh, we're not keeping a secret. We're all trapped in here. So you admit you're not allowed to leave. Yes. Uh, it's not that we're not allowed to leave. We can't. Physically can't leave. There's no way out. Threatening me is not going to help you. But in any case, that sounds an awful lot like a cult to me. And I saw the inscription saying, the many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I take it this is some kind of mantra you all believe? Uh, it's not a mantra. It's a warning. Uh, a distinction without a difference. You've clearly been indoctrinated into this nonsense. Uh oh. Now tell me, where did you lot get enough gold to make all these statues? They were once people who returned to gold as punishment. You lot are practicing human sacrifice too. You people disgust me. We didn't turn to gold. A god did it. And we don't know which one. Of course you'd say that. But that's what your kind do, isn't it? Our god. Told us oh to god, this it. isn't going well. It's all clear to me now. The secret sanctuary, the indoctrination, the mantra, the human sacrifice. You're cultists. There's no doubt in my mind. What baffles me is how a person can believe in something with such zeal. They just can't see what they've become. Am I dead? However, you still have a chance to redeem yourself by telling me where Quintius is. Do not waste it. 
Uh, I have no idea who or where he is. Can, what can you tell me about Quinctius? What is it going to take for you to let this go? Gold? Take all the gold you want. I wouldn't help you even if I... I'm going to be honest with him. I don't know who or where he is. <sighs> then you're of no use to me. Do you have any last words? Uh, you said you wouldn't kill me if I said the truth. Jesus Christ, you're an idiot. If you fire out, everyone here is going to die. Do you? As a matter of fact, I do. Once I'm done with you and Quintius, I intend to kill every last one of you wretched degenerates. And I can think of nothing I'd enjoy more. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. They're chasing me? No, we're okay. Uh, Sentius. Ah! Stuck. Bleh. I need to get over there. Things are getting black. Oh my god. I can't see anything. Oh my. Uh, search. No items. Okay. Right. So you can reset if you make it to the portal and back. Whew. friend all right mate we've had this conversation before uh, i don't think so i've never seen you before in my life your name is gallius you're about to offer me uh to take me to sentius the same way about golden rule oh i guess how much did i drink last night uh sorry to have bothered you no problem oh and since you seem to be in a hurry you should try out this device i made worked real hard on it Oh, a zipline! A rudimentary wooden zipline handlebar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just attach the pulley to the rope over the lake and hang on to the handles. If it works, it'll be faster than walking. And if it doesn't work, worst thing that can happen is you'll take a swim in the lake. I haven't quite summoned the courage to do it, test it myself. But don't worry, it's completely safe. Probably. Thanks. All right, see you around. Well, that didn't go very well, did it? Let's be honest. Livia? No, we should go speak to Thingy about the, the dude. Just as the ocean accepts the rivers of all the world, so this place accepts all the souls. But it does not notice the crowds that come. Uh, yeah, the whatever. Newly arrived. Shut up. Uh, do we save all our quests? Oh, we do. We need to ask Fa Fabia. She'll be alive this time, right? Fortune smile on you, brother. Fear is proof of a degenerate mind. Oh, don't mind me. I just live here. We never spoke to this woman, but I want to solve this graffiti issue. And I went this Fear way. That was proof down. of a degenerate mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. And Fabia was this way. Help! 
You have to do something. A man arrived in the baths. Real nasty sort, with his face all covered up. And he's got a weapon. You have to do something, or he's gonna break the golden rule. Uh I'll get right on it. This is what we did before. Let's see what I can do. Thank you. He's still in there somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this no. empty shrine when it's over. No. Do not go in there. What? Why? Just trust me. All right, um, fine. Come and find me in my bakery instead. Please be careful. Let's go follow up. She gonna ask us about the guy? Did you stop him? Uh, not yet. What are you waiting for? We have to stop. What's this say? Secundus and Cynthia were together until the end. Do we have to learn about Quintius before we um, meet the guy? Maybe. The cultists. Do I know where the cultists are? One's actually a historical reference. This is just a shrine. We've come full circle, I think. Good lord. Can we use this? Can we use it from the other end? I don't, Lewis. No, I, I, um, I, I know as much as you do at this point. I wasn't even expecting it to be a thing yet. Um, oh, oh. it is. Glarious. This is the tailor, right? I think. We could steal the money, but. Cerberus lifts his triple head and lets out his threefold praying. Metal device designed to stop people from cheating when rolling dice. They follow their traits, imitating their previous lives, but they are ignorant. You're super hyped? Yeah, me too. Me too. Uh, it's almost worth. Old chest. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Worth playing the original game just because we know a new one's coming out. Okay. This is the farm, isn't it? Behavior, I trust. Do we know? What is it, citizen? Uh. Hmm. Do we All know right. where Quinctius is? Fresh meat, huh? Who are you? A new face. And may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? Who was your story? Oh my. I take it people are quite direct where you're from. I suppose it's quite charming in its own way. Usually, however, you wouldn't simply march up to a Vestal priestess and without due formality or courtesy ask, 
What is your story? Agreed. The proper approach would be to arrange an introduction through a mutual acquaintance in high office, by which time your mind you mixed up two Roman graffiti scribbles and into then one. You would find oh, a way okay. to satisfy your curiosity rather more indirectly. But to be honest, I've often thought what an unnecessarily formal way to communicate that is. So let's do it your way. You just keep being yourself and ask whatever you like. It'll be a refreshing change. Um, I can only hope, uh, Lewis, that we get more, I mean, more advancement on the gameplay and the story, of course, in Remnant 2. I really hope we're not going to get very minor changes in the next game, but, I mean, I'll take it. If we just get new bosses, to be fair, I'll take that. I, I love that game. It was great. Uh, okay. How did you end up here? You know, I'm not entirely sure. But what about you? How did you end up here? One of the famous scribbles is We Two Dear Men, Friends Forever, We're Here. If you want to know our names, they are Ga Gaius, 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 and Alus, Alulus. Neither one is essentially spam scribble. Secundus defecated here. Three time on one wall, nice. You can't lose stamina in combat, and the minimap is 3D. Yeah. I just, I want more, though. Like, I want it to be very much. Of, I want it to be very obvious why it's a second.